Cheryl Blossom, a.k.a. Cheryl Bombshell, which means I need no reasons. I simply am. Feel free to tremble. I have a better idea. Why don't you tell me what's bothering you? Because clearly, you're in a lot of pain. Get your sapphic serpent hands off my body! She said I was deviant. Cheryl, I am so sorry. But you have to know your mother's wrong. You're not loveless. You're not deviant, okay? You're sensational. I didn't want to invite all the girls tonight. But I knew my hideous mother would never allow me to invite just you. Which is what I crave. I lost someone special to me too. Her name was Kostya. She was captured by the Ice Nation, whose queen believed she knew my secrets. It's okay. You're safe. Wait. I was wrong about you, Clark. Your heart shows no sign of weakness. Maybe life should be about more than just surviving. Don't we deserve better than that? Maybe we do. to me in my sleep. I saw their deaths. A war. The hands of an assassin. Just a nightmare. No. No, it's a warning. They think I'm betraying their legacy. Just strange, just down has always, always been the way of our people. I should have recruited you to the Time Bureau. Britain knows I didn't release a team. You're on mistake. <laughs> you want to take a break? I could use some water. Yeah. Well, we're not exactly helpless. Fine, I'll go fix Gideon. And I'm gonna go catch a serial killer. You are way too excited about this.
This isn't your problem. Yes, it is. And I'm gonna fix this. Let's rehearse what you're gonna say to the police. So you say we don't have to rehearse? Yeah. I changed my mind. JR, I wasn't expecting you. Sorry, I'm, I'm not dressed. I have an update from the DA. Looks like I got you off. Really? Yeah. In the dark, in the night, senses wake, I'm alive. No, I'm really gonna get you off. <gasps> it's unclear which one here well, that's one kind of... Getting back into the swing of waitressing. Thanks for letting me pick up shifts. <laughs> did you just giggle? No. <clears throat> I do not giggle. You did. You giggled. And you're blushing. Who was that? No one. And I'm not. <laughs> oh my god, you have a crush. Did someone just ask you to the prom? No, I do not have a crush. And no one's going to... What makes you think I haven't been with a woman? Have you? Yes. Several. I'm also your lawyer. That wouldn't be the first line you've crossed. Oh my. I'm not the blackmail robot. Ooh. Look, I didn't expect to feel like this about you. But here we are. And I'm in love with you. You are? I knew it was in the draft from the window. Yes. So I don't want to do anything out of convenience or obligation or guilt. I only want to move in if we're both on the same page emotionally. And if you're not there yet, I'm willing to wait. It's a lesbian. I mean, they must have. Do I smell like a golf course? They don't know what you're hiding. They just, they know that you're not being yourself. If you were to embrace all of the awesomeness that you are, you would have won. How do you know? Because I voted for you. And because I believe in you, Santana. <laughs> this prom sucks. <laughs> now what am I supposed to do? Go back out there and be there for Kurt. This is gonna be a lot harder for him than it is for you. Hey, do you like my shirt for Glee Club? One's perfect. Check out mine. What? This is perfect. Legend has it that when I came out of my mother, I told the nurse she was fat. Well, I made a different one for you. I'm Hispanic. Wait, was that supposed to be lesbian? Yeah, isn't that what it says? When you told me all that stuff the other week, it meant so much to me to see you be so honest. Especially because I know how bad it hurt. I was so proud of you. Yeah, well, don't get used to it. And certainly don't even think about telling anyone. Why not? You're like the most awesomest girl at the school. Why would you try to hide any of that? Dating Karofsky, no. It's gross. You don't get a say in who I date anymore. Why not? Because I'm dating somebody? Because you're Lebanese and I think I'm bicurious? No. Because I said I love you. You didn't say you love me back. I do love you. Clearly, you don't love you as much as I do, or you'd put this shirt on, you'd dance with me. Right. I want to talk about, um, you know, that thing that we never talk about. What, that sour patch is, or just gummy bears that turn to drugs? Are we dating? Or what? Wait, isn't this a date? Aren't you paying? Because I ordered shrimp. Wasn't last week when we were taking a bath together, wasn't that a date? Are you crying? It's just that I'm really happy. Well, I told you last year that if I'm single and you're single, that we'd mingle. And if there's any controversy that interferes with my presidential campaign, then I'll use one of my leprechaun wishes to win the election. You you think that great kazoo kid is the leprechaun? Well, yeah, Roy's from Ireland. That means he's, like, made of magic. Don't you have any wishes that you, like, really, really want to come true? Yeah, I do. 
I'm thinking of joining Shelby's new show choir. If I did, would you join me? I'm so sick of always paying back up to Rachel Berry. I want to shine and be seen as the star that I am. But I won't join without you. I don't really want to be known as a quitter. Doesn't my presidential campaign need continuity? Can I think about it for like a day? Yeah. No, totally. I understand. You know, just think about it. But in the meantime, I do have one more wish. Mm-hmm. I wish you'd hold my hand. Like, under the napkin. All of tiny flowers You used to call them weeds And you killed them all What? I can't hear you! I said, wake up, Marceline. I dreamed about you while I was in my poison coma. I was all old and withered, and you were still nice and pink. You think I'm nice? Y'all oh, brains, I lost count. That's okay. I'm done with bat jacks. But those varmints are still out there, waiting. Eh, worry about it tomorrow. I'll keep a lookout tonight. I will watch the heck out of this pumpkin patch. Come on. Okay. Maybe for a bit. Don't let me sleep too long. Promise to wake me up in 15 minutes. I promise. I don't want to lose you again. Hey, I'm a tough gum. Nothing never happening to me. Never. I know, I'm... Girl, you phrased that so weird. I might have a concussion. <laughs> Look, new kid from Newton. Casey is my name. <laughs> I'm sure you were a hot shit at your last crappy school, but wow. over here... Warm welcome. We should put you in the orientation video. But I've heard about you. Good things? You punched your girl in the face and got suspended, so no. <laughs> I've worked my ass off to build this team, and we don't need any drama. Um, I don't want any drama either. I'm... Don't care. Just handle yourself. You know, I knew you two were gonna fall in love. <laughs> hey, if, uh, if you guys ever hook up... Don't forget to include me. Mm. Yeah, okay. Polar animals know that if they want to survive, they need creatures like them. I'm so... I can't do it. No, keep reading. No, I'm <laughs> sobbing. It's too scary. Thank you for building this ridiculous fort and reading these scary books just to keep my mind off of what's going on. Yeah. We can stay in here forever if you want. We can pee in the can and do college classes online. We can, oh, yeah. you know, get old here and... Get a couple cats. <laughs> Newton? Yeah. This might sound lame, but <laughs> you're like my new favorite person. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> Is that tragic since we just met a little while ago? No. You're my new favorite person, too. But don't tell Cherise, because she will kill you. Got it? Hey, dorks! Look what I found at the thrift store. And I brought pie to make up for it. Sam, I said no tweed. Oh, my bad. I thought you said only tweed. We'll make it work. No, what time will Evan be arriving? He's working, so uh, Izzy's filling in. I'm her date. Oh, okay. Tweed suit, new guest. I mean, what's in the pie? Dog poop? <laughs> That you were gonna be all weird and that this was gonna jeopardize our friendship. I never in a million years would have told you how I felt. Because it is becoming incredibly clear that you don't feel the same way. <sighs> I'm so confused. Me? Yeah. After Slurpee night, you were like, it's good to have friends. We're friends. 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 What was I supposed to say? I don't know the truth. When I told you the truth, you ran away. True. 
I'm sorry. You came around. No way, Casey. What? Since you're marrying Austin, I'll be your sister now. Promise me something, Sue. Okay, promise me two things. One, that you won't move away to Michigan. And two, That you'll always love me more than him. As far as the first one goes, it's really Austin's decision. But as far as the second, yeah. Well, I wouldn't worry too much about that one. Sleep. Yes. Don't do that, it's creepy. Well, I'll never do it again since you won't be sleeping here anymore. Are you telling me to go back to the boarding house? I'm just saying, you won't be sleeping in my bed when you and my brother get married. By the way, you know Austin eats cookies at night? Crumbs go. I want to go back to sleep. I can't sleep with you next to me. Why not? Because there's like this... rumbling. And it rumbles. And rumbles. <sighs> Do you mean I snore? I wish I could just marry you. You'd be a terrible husband. How can you say that? You have no practical skills. And you're too small to fend off enemies. Okay, fine. But I bet I look good in a suit. City boys, Mississippi boys, in the city boys. I like the pretty boys with the bow tie. Get your nails did, let it blow dry. I like a big, big... I mean, why don't we just put a bit in the patient's mouth? Would you like some help with this? Are you Jewish? No. Why? You answered a question with a question. So you trained with Jason Kalfas? Yeah. Did you sleep with him? No. Shoot drugs with him? No. Oh, God, no. Hey, don't be defensive. This is just us getting to know each other. Sorry. Stop apologizing. I'm not used to... I have an Israeli disposition. I keep a kosher home, I leave early on Fridays, and when I get married, I will probably wear a wig. Do you have a problem with any of that? Nope. Good. First case, 34-year-old, five months pregnant, fell putting up a mobile. You were great with Mr. Zarb. I might have been hasty in sending that email. Thanks. It was a good day. You know, today we kind of fast forwarded through a shittick. What is that? It's an orthodox thing. It's when you go on a series of dates and you talk about big things like morals and values and by the end of it, you know if you're compatible or not. I'm going to say we didn't pass with flying colors. No, we did not. But it didn't make me want to be with you any less. Maggie, I don't want some epic, tortured love affair with you. I just want you. Okay. 
Promise me you're not going to leave again. I'm not going anywhere without you. I did want to get on that plane. I was so mad and disappointed. I'm sorry. No, no, no. Not at you. At myself for pushing you away. I'm so glad you came. Attention, passengers. We have a gate change. I got your letter. I think the first word is to love. <laughs> Yeah, but it's really hard to find someone who reads Hebrew. Yeah, because there's no Jewish doctors working at a hospital. <laughs> no. I was standing in that office, and it was everything I'd worked for. And all I could think about is you. <laughs> I love you. And I'd give everything up to be with you. I would, too. That's why I didn't get on the plane. I guess we both give it all up. <laughs> Is everything okay? <laughs> so good. You? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think it's just allergies or something. Is it just me or is there, like, an impossible amount of pollen in the air? I think I read that somewhere. Not enough bees or some shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's gotta be it. <laughs> if you are a tutorial, check you too. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to stare. But now that I know I'm like a total freak, maybe I'm free <laughs> to be who I really am and to be honest about who I want to be with. Let that go, are you? Carolina, I was always going to come back for you. I'm sure you had your reasons. I'm sure they had nothing to do with the fact that Carolina and Nico developed a certain chemistry. I wasn't aware of that at the time, okay? And I'm... Still trying to process that information, actually, but thanks for bringing it up, though. So what are you doing? My savior, my soulmate. I've I've known you for like five minutes. The love of my life. Will you be my? Sorry. Am I interrupting? Who the hell is this? Okay. Everything's gonna be alright. I promise. I love you. I love you. See you back at the hostel in an hour. Okay, your mom is definitely driving this thing. I'm gonna lead it away. Wait! Relax a little.